So what's the procedure here, John? Well, I have to start pulling in the anchor. Uh -huh. When I can see which way the um, chain is pointing, then I have to tell Garth because he has to point the boat in that direction. Okay, I'm, I'm starting to pull it up now. Bye bye. So this is the part of the journey we're starting to head back to split. Hopefully we've got some choppy weather there so we can start sailing home. Got some decent waves. Wind of about 8 knots or 7 knots. Visibility 20 kilometers. Mostly clear. Sim Brodoima Ordia Dubrovnik Radio. The main, they've got the jib up and it's um, wind's pushing us from behind so did about seven knots. Well, we're doing five knots at the moment. It's, the wind has just calmed down. We had 20 knots a little way back. Now we're on 18 knots and it's kind of uh, almost coming from behind the wind. Not quite. Coming from that direction. We could put the mainsail up, but it's very mm -mm. choppy and it's a bit not so nice to stand up on deck and fiddle around with all of the, all of the things that we need doing there. You're going to do sick for the vlog, John? No, no I don't do it. Um, not for the camera. <laughs> <laughs> this is uh, one lucky bee here. It's a big I one. Huh? To find some land. It's not really land. It's too slippery for it. It can't hold on. It's trying to get a grip. It's getting stung.
So we left Millet, which is uh, past this outcrop here and then over the horizon even further. And now we're going over to over there to try and find a, a boy. What, what's the name of the place we're going to? I think it's called Gradina. Gradina. So we've tacked a few times. I think four times we tacked. Uh, changed directions. We had to do an engine about half the way, but it's my little pack. I did promise you that I'll show you the engine. Also, if I get an urge during the night, look at the engine. I can do so here. Oh, that's not good. Okay, press this. So I'm making a primitive fish hook fishing thing and I'm going to try and catch some fish. I'm going to take one of the white strands from this paracord. Well, each, each one of these has another one you can use like that. So much cordage in here. So we got a stick and we got a hook, sweet corn, and there's a fish. I'm just going to leave the stick here and see if anything catches onto it. If the stick goes, we know that it worked. <laughs> Tack, or what? Motor? I think there's, I mean, the purple means no wind. Right. So we're basically going to probably cross up to here, I would guess, to VAR by motor. And then if we come forwards to like two o'clock in the afternoon, then we start, this wind starts to pick up when it turns blue. Yeah. It's still quite low, 10 knots maybe, but this passage that we then have to go north from VAR, uh, yeah, there's a good chance that we can we can sail that, which would be nice. Is that CMAPS program, yeah? No, this is... Uh, Wind finder. All oh, right. This is just about wind, wind and where it is, which direction. And nice it comes looking from. Yeah. So, right. yeah, oh. and by uh, by the end. Good night, folks. That's the end of day five.